Springfield now where the city council has passed a bill paving the way for e-scooters throughout the city. A very popular mode of getting around a lot of other cities across the country. Yes, our Parker Padgett is live at City Hall. Parker, what's next now that the vote is over? Yeah, Mike, Sarah, this vote simply changes the rules in Springfield regarding these e-scooters, but with new rules comes new regulations. It's important to point out that the city of Springfield is not providing these scooters. Rather, they're allowing companies to apply for licensing to rent out scooters. The ordinance, the ordinance says these e-scooters would only be available from 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. each day. One of the biggest concerns was the possibility of these scooters becoming a public nuisance, whether it's irresponsible operation or scooters being parked wherever or just left in spots by riders. The ordinance outlines rules for companies looking to rent out scooters that would protect the devices, the people, and the quality of the sidewalks and streets. Language in the bill says it's able to impound any scooters left in roadways, blocking pedestrian traffic, or if they belong to a renting company with no license. The ordinance also states that if you're operating one of these e-scooters, you must yield to pedestrian traffic. Mayor Ken McClure shared some concerns over safety. We'll have that for you later this evening. Reporting live in Springfield, Parker Padgett, Ozarks First.